parent involvement of 1980s versus parent involvement of today. So a couple of real key things stood out to me from this article and really the primary one is an over optimism in the availability of parent resource and the consistency of that resource. That is a really big deal and we really understand it in a very direct way today as a really big stratifying element between demographic, class, uh, and socioeconomic um, want. Now, student and parent involvement are still really important elements and the, the parent modeling of a positive attitude uh, in particularly modeling uh, good reading skills and reading to students when students are at that kind of vulnerable K through four age group, um, basically learning how to read or becoming literate is really important. Um, the big difference comes in thought when students are moving into middle school and high school. This is when students need parents more in the capacity of checking in, uh, a helpful support, but less so on the tutoring. Uh, one of the biggest reasons for that is, first of all, it can be very difficult for students or for teacher or for parents because they're coming in out of context. Uh, there's the inconsistency of, of parents teaching, reteaching or tutoring in ways that are not consistent with helping or helping student get the lesson. But the biggest issue that I take with parent over-involvement in the middle and high school age is that students, um, students at this age developmentally need to be learning how to learn, but also learning how to self-advocate and seek, seek support systems within the school itself. It's a learning culture there for them designed to help them and it shouldn't be viewed as a kind of punitive structure um, to to entrap them or to you know reprimand them harshly when they make mistakes but instead is is the best support system available and can actually target and help those students the best and for students to learn that positive relationship with educational systems institutions and not be so fearful of making the mistakes uh, is a huge lesson and one of the biggest effects from I think this 1980s perspective on inclusion of parenting and almost over parenting was the resulting helicopter parent that in so many cases really produced undue stress in students and in many ways um, didn't allow students to have faith and confidence in their own ability to think and learn because they were uh, or continue to be too afraid to make those mistakes. Um, because of the fear that uh, the parents are there, they're watching and they're, they're ever present. So um, having, having faith in a student's own ability to build a relationship, an adult relationship with other adults, particularly their teachers, is a really important developmental stage for students, which this article doesn't necessarily cite that much, but I think has been well addressed in the years since this article was written. Thank you.